All right, hello and welcome back to the second episode of Carrier Command Guy Mission. Uh, so first off, the good news uh, doesn't seem to have been any audio problems. Like, doesn't seem to have been out of sync or anything. Uh, now let's see if there's other news. Nope, still doesn't like it. it still doesn't like being recorded, but I don't know. It looks a little better. Maybe? I don't fucking know. Either way, one monitor or two doesn't make a difference, so might as well just leave it at one and stick with that. It's not like I use the second monitor very often anyway, only when I'm recording just to make sure audio is all nicely balanced and whatnot, and it seems fine. It seems fine at the moment. So I'll just leave it as it is. Okay, so... Tactical. Alright. This one's on refinery. Well, I'm clicking on it for information display, but nothing's happening. But I'd like to know s some useful information about this map, but... Oh, there we go. That in way. Ooh, it's a really shit zone. It's got basically negatives on resource and production, so it's not the best. This one, on the other hand, is slightly better at production. Uh, it, and slightly better on production, but that's it. Alright, let's get over there. We got resources incoming, but that's it. <clears throat> but this one will let us begin producing stuff. I don't think I even have the ability to equip my stuff. Yeah, production. Undock, dock, equip. Yeah, it's weapon, armor, and utility, if I recall. Yeah, ammo, if I recall, the two conditions are no ammo, no oil, and low fuel. And no fuel, of course. And fuel, basically, they're, they're, they're all electric vehicles. Basically. And the all achievements. Gain control over Arachnid. Well, once the time warp gets us there, we will. Yeah. So let's see. I think we like clash, clashed, crashed somewhere around here. Okay, how close are we? Uh, also, I think you can cancel the time warp and then like, like at a different point, you don't have to go here. You can land somewhere else and then infiltrate from a different point. Yes, and we only get the one. Control of the command center, we would have control over the entire island. It's possible though that some of the units will not be affected what? and will try to Hold on. until they are completely destroyed. What why does my wars have like no battery? Who was in charge of this that who was in charge of recharge? Come on, someone dropped the ball on giving my boy some fuel. Come on, who was it? Lazy bastards. No fuel for my warriors. How sad. So sad. 
doesn't matter. Ah, uh, one thing I do remember is... Is, um, like, the most important thing I do remember is, uh... If you set a supply point... Like, um... If you set an island as your stockpile, where you send, um, get sent resupply in vehicles, weapons, armor, um, basically that will be both, that'll utilize both production and, um, production and resource, um, refining. So that way, if you get an island that's got, like, good on both, turn that into a stockpile for your front line. Why can't I... What's wrong? Why can't I- Oh, that's why I can't fucking turn. Well, I'm going after him. At the moment, if I lose this, it's game over. Because I only got the one and I lack the ability to produce more. Which kind of sucks, but they, that's how it is. Uh, if I recall, there are repair locations. There are fuel locations on maps so you can like repair as you go Re basically repair resupply as you go which is pretty cool maybe I should get the first executive assault I wonder if that has a campaign worth recording that might be that might be a thing to do I should look at that after I'm done here oh I need to grab my phone and make sure I've got things for names. Don't want to forget that. Like, the game does have a good, like, just, uh, what's, like, a good conquest mode, I'd say. Yeah, and the front door's blocked. For, who, who's in control of these islands? No, that's not what I wanted to do. Suspend. I don't want you to go back and dock. I need to maintain con direct control. I think, like, the best thing about this is you can see your tracks as you drive. That's pretty cool. Like, there's no... Like, the one thing I remember... The biggest thing I remember is using... One really good thing I remember... Is, basically, you'd... I would send Manta in... Yeah, like, what I remember is I would send, I would manually pilot a Manta, and I would just fly all across the island, getting, like, map data, destroying turrets if I could, but I would fly all across the island, getting all the valuable information I could. Boy, like, can't just have it, mm, automatically. Oh shit, I thought it was actually dead. Yes, I know, but I need repairs and I need fuel. Yeah. I'll have to go over there and get that fuel next before proceeding. I should be able to, at this distance, take out that motor pool. Well, if I had more, this would be a lot easier, but I don't even know if I can destroy it with just one and a mach bloody shit machine gun. Because like, I know, like, some of the weapons you get later are pretty damn good. I know, I'm dealing with it, but I need to resupply on multiple things at once, for fuck's sake. Don't be a dick, I'll get to it. Oh god, I took so much damage from crashing like that. And it's not fuel, it's generators, clearly. Uh, that's an anti-air gun, don't need to worry about that very much. I don't have any Manta. Alright, that should be sufficient, let's move on. You know what, let's go get this guy down here. You prick. Moving on, we'll leave the anti-air.
Yeah. Let's go take a look, shall we? Uh, there are research places on like different islands. Yes, we can also find various repair places like I just came from over here. Alright, uh, let's just have you manually drive over there for the moment. Oh yeah, we got a Manta Garage, anti-air platform. Like, I would take Mantas and I would just do strafing runs across the islands. Like, across the island, getting, like, I... I would basically strip it of its armor. And I would just scream across the island, finding all these locations. Basically scouting the island before I ventured forth and did what I could first before getting in there with like actual air support and stuff like that. What do you mean the gate is closing quick? It's already closed. Sir, it appears there is a gate controller system in the central west part of the island. Central the two west. Antennas need to be activated practically simultaneously. I doubt we could manage it with just one walrus. For security reasons, the time frame needed for deactivation is very short. But search the factory complex. The enemy may have stored some walruses that we can use for this mission. Yeah, I'm already sending my walrus over there to do the, just that, milady. Uh, for instance, in terms of other attack points on this island, <coughs> I'd say... Uh, probably down here looks like a good one, just judging by the map. You could come up here, and then into that way. You can also come up this way, like, go in with a beach assault. Looks like a good one. Okay. Perfect. Breaking through the factory entrance is worth it. We found another walrus. This will definitely help. I can't tell if that also has a machine gun. It looks like a different weapon. I mean, it might be, but I rarely remember using machine guns because they kind of suck. Yeah, or you can just do this. Uh, yeah, this and yeah, yeah, seven assist six. Emergency talk. Defense, aggressive, undock, move, assist, yeah. Yeah, we got P for park and then six on assist. Okay, so uh, over here, I guess. Though it says two, where's the other one? Actually, you know what? Let's move you. Oh, actually, it might be. No, I think it actually might be fine. So we got one thing here that we have to do. I think that's the other antenna over here. Yep, that's it right here. Sir, we did it. The gate to the main base is open. Now there's almost nothing stopping us from reaching the command center. Well. Yeah, I'll just have you guys come back over here. You guys meet back up over there, and then we'll have you head into the command center. Just in case there's something in there. I do like that I can just observe from... without controlling. And then just switch back like this. It's quite nice, really. Just watching them do the commands I issued. What, what are you doing? I'll just have you go over there. It's like once I get more and have them either more move as one is pretty cool. 
Alright, you guys get in there. What, what, what kind of move control is that? No, just... What? 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 Well, uh, whatever. Fuck it. Assuming direct control. <laughs> what? Whatever. Oh shit. I know I should have gone in more smoothly. Where's my support? Hacking again, there was like one specific point. Of course, now I don't remember. Why wasn't it assisting? That's where I have to go. It stopped it from taking control. Well, that sucks. That sucks. If I recall, you have to build... The hacking module gets expended when it's complete. Excellent. The command center was successfully reprogrammed. We now have control over the entire island. The enemy units are now ours and will defend the island for us. Yeah, and now they'll come back in to dock. Okay, who's gonna get there first? Okay, six is having a bit of a problem maneuvering sufficiently. Number seven is certainly getting underway quite easily. He seems to be reacquiring an appropriate path. Number seven is well ahead. Of course, now we only have to wait. I might as well just assume direct control and just get you there. Well, that's right. Each uh, island can have um, battlefield hazards. Yeah, you're going to lose this race. Take it from number seven's view now. Yeah, they're doing all right. This still, this guy's still got a ton of fuel, but then he didn't really move very much to begin with. Most of the time, I think it's better to just take control of all of them, from the, like especially the warrises anyway. Just take control of them like this, and. Just to have them go out. Just have them control themselves most of the time until you get to the Manta. Then you can, like, have the Manta assist the Warus and just, like, provide air support. But the problem with Manta is they're pretty weak and can easily be destroyed until you give them, like, the good heavy armor. But even then, having them, like, be air support the entire time is pretty risky. Pretty risky. And they're docked. Alright. Yeah, another fuel depot. But apparently I don't have any f resources actually coming in yet. So I guess I haven't really done anything. Oop, that's not what I wanted. Okay, where the hell are we coming into dock? Alright. 
I'm looking. Do you want me to look at this one specifically? Okay. What? What do you want me to do? I, I don't know what you want me to do. Ship lock. Shows about information. Uh, uh, wait, this need to be tracked. Right here, production. First entry should general information. That's the actual defense show uses the current defense rating. Uh, which is indicated before attacking. Yeah, the actual defense is pretty weak. Nothing to worry about. Uh, but also, I'd like to come in from this point. So I can just come up here and then just immediately go in there, but I don't know what I'm doing here, so we'll not do that. It's like also at this point I can actually take manual control and have the ship. Like once the ship also has guns, you can like assault enemy defense positions on on the ground. Like using like long range cannons and shit. It's pretty cool. I really do like the game, but I wish it didn't have problems recording. Like, it seems to be going just a little bit better with only one screen, but still. D what? Why are you going over there? Alright, equip. Yeah, I know how it works. I know. You should see the weapons I mentioned on the left hand side. If you select the weapon in the list, the middle section displays detailed information. I know how it works, dude. I know how it works. I'm not entirely sure why it's sending me over here already though, but why not? Not sure why it's the ship is coming over this way. But you know what we'll go. Oh, I have no control. Why don't I have control over where the ship goes? Okay, well, uh, I'll wait till the ship stops moving and then deploy my Warris. Just actually need to group together, it is possible to do this. Yeah, I know how it works, but. Okay, good boys, get over there. We're gonna come in from the coast and hit that base just outside the command center. Like, if I'm taking direct control, sure, assist is fine. But when I'm doing it like this, not so much. I think it was gonna be actually by holding. No, it can't. No, it cannot, game. You are telling lies. Don't be mean by telling lies such as this. Alright, seven's at the b behind, so let's get a view from there. The war is coming in with an oceanic assault. Right, let's have you guys come in over here. Move in together. Hit landfall first. Cool. That's it, move up, move up. Get in there. Take out the tower turret first. See, look at that, look at how good they do with their own controls. Isn't that nice? Alright, let's get you guys over here and we'll prepare to make the attack on the command center. Get guys, what, what, what are you doing? 
Don't don't get stuck on each other now. Oh, hello. Oh, that's a big gun. Why does this place have a big gun? The defenses are supposed to be weak. That that's some that's some good defense right there. What the hell? I did look and it said weak, right? Pull back! Pull back! I don't know why voice audio is so damn low. Like, there's music and sound effects. There is no control for voice. There should always be control for voice. <sighs> okay, you guys are repaired. Uh, you know what? I might as well just have you both resupply on ammo. Why not? There's no reason not to. Yeah, it says weak. Weak my ass. Yeah. Uh, he probably has to move out of the way. There we go. Okay, let's get you guys down here. Take the view from number seven. I know, I'm dealing with it. You don't have to keep talking about it. Attack this. Number six, what are you doing? Jesus Christ, guys. Sometimes you just gotta take control. You know what? Uh, number seven can do the job well enough. You go back and get repaired. Uh, number seven can do the job. Number six can go back and get repairs. Uh, over here. I have a feeling the other one's on a different part of the island. Like, on the eastern side. How annoying. Yeah, it's over there. Alright, you guys can regroup there. Alright, uh, I'm gonna stop there. It's been 28 minutes, uh, so that's pretty good for episode 2, I think. So I hope people enjoyed. Later.